Many components of an aircraft are life-limited, so that they must be periodically replaced or maintained. Typical parameters that affect the serviceability of aircraft and components are the time since installation, the flight hours, the number of takeoffs and landings, the area of operation of the aircraft, the intended use. Regardless of these parameters, aircraft maintenance in the early days of aviation history was carried out on the basis of the mechanic's experience. The main focus was on the replacement of components and parts. This changed at the latest at the beginning of the 1980s. Since then, the MSG-3 logic is used by all major aircraft manufacturers to determine the type and scope of maintenance. This is a standardized decision tree methodology from which the type of maintenance action is derived. This approach is preventive and, in addition to safety aspects, is also oriented towards flight operations and economic necessities. The MSG-3 technique does not generally focus on the occurrence of a failure, but on its effects. The decisive factor is not so much whether errors or failure occurs, but rather how it affects flight safety. In this respect, the term consequence of failure approach is also used here. This concept is based on various types of maintenance that are used in parallel today. Hard time maintenance, on condition maintenance, condition monitoring. We now explain these three approaches in more detail. Give us a call or send us an email if you are interested in this e-learning.